you live in Oregon. Mm-hmm. And you're a cheerleader in high school. Yes, I'm a junior. And yep. you are big into riding horses and showing horses and mules. Is that correct? Well, I did a lot of that before I was shooting. And when I found out the like whole shooting rate, uh, course, I had to make a choice. I was only 12 when I had to make this big choice of mine. And it was between shooting or competitive horse riding. They, they are both fabulous skills. Oh yeah, uh, I was very, I'm very accomplished in the horse riding world and everything. And then I just thought to myself, I'm like, well, I've done the plenty with the riding of horses and stuff like that. I want to try something new. So I started this, and I just took off with it. What What are your favorite activities in school, Dusty? Well, I am very big in math. I'm a math whiz. Uh, I like the, like, I, the reason I like math is just it reminds me so much of shooting because, like, you have to do all the equations, like, linear equations, all those, just like you have to do with shooting when you are figuring out the wind and um, elevation. So it kind of reminds me of that, and that's why I like doing it. Plus, I'm a big math person because I want to be a mechanical engineer when I'm older. Holy cow. So, you've, you've got some aspirations, Dusty. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How long have you been um, shooting? I've been only shooting for four years. Wow. You've won some awards. You've done very well in the shooting world already. I've accomplished a lot in the last four years of me shooting, especially in Oregon. I've gotten so many state titles underneath my belt. Wow. Now, what's your favorite type? Uh, what, what are you best at? For shooting? Yeah. Um. Well... I'm still improving on all of it that I'm shooting, but my favorite is long range. Long range, yeah, like like Annette Walker. Yes. She, is she one of your role models? Oh, I love Annette. She's like, I have learned so much from her in the last like two years. I've known her. Isn't she a nice person? She's a great person. That's unbelievable. And she's doing some three gun now. Are you doing any three gun? No, nope, not into that yet. <laughs> but are, are you, perhaps you're going to do some maybe in the future? I'm not sure yet. I got to see where school takes me first. Good for you. You've got your priorities straight. That's for sure. As a young woman, how important do you feel women are in protecting our Second Amendment rights right now? I'm, I'm actually doing a project in school right now about a Second Amendment um, in government, really, we got to choose the, the like the first, the Bill of Rights, one of the Bill of Rights, and I and of course I chose the Second Amendment. What do the kids in school? I mean, there is so much negativity about firearms in schools. How do people treat you in school? How do the the instructors and the students feel about your love of firearms in the Second Amendment? They really don't treat me different. They they um they think it's cool. My principal's way behind it on everything. I tell her that, like, when I'm ready to leave, if I leave for a week or something for a mat, I talk to her about it and everything. She says, that's so cool. And uh, most of my teachers, they go for it. They give me my assignments on the way there so I can do them. Really? So they actually enable you to do your shooting? Yeah. My freshman year of high school, the second semester... So, like, after December, I had an interview done for the local newspaper and of my shooting and everything, and they saw it, and they put it up everywhere in school. Really? Isn't that yep. wonderful? I loved And this, did you go to a public school? Yes. I just go to a small-town public school. That's terrific to hear that a public school is so behind you and so supportive of you. Do you have any advice for young women who look up to you as a role model, Dusty? Well, my biggest thing that pushed me through, like, what helped me through this is adapt and overcome. That yep. has been, like, my biggest thing since I've been doing this. Because, like, there's so many different, like, difficult things that you have to overcome in shooting. Like, you can't be getting frustrated. You can't be getting mad. Nothing. Especially if you, like, shoot a bad shot. You honestly have to adapt and overcome it. Well, listen, Dusty, I really appreciate your time. No, thank you. Okay, Merry Christmas, Dusty. Merry Christmas, you too. Thanks.